everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Lifestyle Limitless. We're out here in Hawaii at one of our favorite places called K.A. Beach. It's in Captain Cook. Very beautiful, as you can see. <clears throat> We're going in. It's another spear fishing episode. It's a little bit rough, but sometimes it works in your advantage because the fish can't really see you as well. And I've had really good luck on these types of days when you thought it was a terrible weather to go diving. It actually works out in your advantage. So we're gonna go in and check it out. And we'll see you guys in the water. All right, you got it, you got it. It's beautiful out here. All right, I'm heading out, paddling out. Pops is out here somewhere getting stuck in a current. So I brought the surfboard. I came out earlier and I just kept getting drugged all the way north, so I figured this would be a little easier. Let's go a little over this way, and then we'll drift back. <laughs> All right, you guys, we got this crazy looking broom fish. Just uh, wasn't really too scared of me. So I went in and popped him real quick. It's enough to make some tacos. Look at that vibrant blue. That's just the craziest looking blue. And yeah, that's it. That's catching good broom fish right here at K.A. Beach. I had him in. Good guess. Because there's a hole right there. Alright, well in the end of it, that's what we came out with, making fish tacos. Alright, now we get to the fillets, start a fire up, All right. get this cook going. I think we'll get it off in just a few. Five, four, three. And that's what you eat right there. I think these two is also what you eat, yes. Alright, so these are the fillets. There's not 
not a whole lot on there, but it's enough. Yeah. It's enough for us to have our tacos. Me and Roland are the only ones eating here. Mm -hmm. This throwback in the ocean mm -hmm. goes to the eels. It's from fish. That blood. Yep. All right. This is our makeshift cutting board. Yep. Divers know. All right, we got a little side dish. This is a, a breadfruit, native Hawaiian uh, breadfruit. It's called the ulu. It grows on a big ass tree. It's basically like a potato kind of. They say you can cook it any way that you can cook a potato is like the rule of thumb. But see all this milk that comes out? See that? So you gotta skin it, cut it into slices and then soak it in water to blanch out some of that milk. So we'll just use like the tide pool. We'll just soak it in there and then it'll be getting a little salt water seasoning at the same time. Alright, so we'll let, just let the breadfruit soak in this water for a while to blanch out any of the last bit of that milk. It's just a step that you're supposed to take. You, you, can, not, you can also skip this, but we like to get that out of there. So we'll leave this soaking in here. All right, so this is what came out of that broomfish that I shot, and then my buddy just gave us some uh, cuts of marlin. So we're gonna just mix it in so we have a little more. But that's, if you're wondering where the rest came from. All right, the secret seasoning. Oh, it smells like chicken. Just nice little seasoned chunks. We'll sort of fry it. Tacos, baby. Get up in there close. Sounds good. Cilantro and that'll be perfect. There you go. Yeah. Hold it together. See it. <laughs> we got water when you're ready. Oh, yeah. pretty good. Tea. We should go catch uh, sand crabs at night and eat them too. Mm. All right, everybody. That's it for another episode. We're wrapping it up here. About to get cleaned up. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Hope you enjoyed this as much as we did. And we'll see you next time.